Two Broke Rednecks present. Monty Brava, that guy on the front row for lighting up in church. Hooray, they're having to watch this crappy movie with us. That's because they're in the film. That's so they don't escape. They're trying to riff it, too. I can't hear them. That's because they have shittier equipment than we do. They give the viewer a few seconds to adjust himself to the dark room and the And to say, ah, shit, about viewing the they film. They each individual to participate immediately. And often the main title arouses the viewer's curiosity. Maybe somebody flubbed a riff with The Ooh. main title can do much more than simply state the topic of the film. It can make you question your sexuality. to the nature of the subject Ooh, matter. Ooh, the claw. The previous title card got sacked. At this point, everybody's going, what the hell is a dingbat? Monty Python and the dingbat story. The subject matter, so the viewer will know what to expect. Lakaja I follies with clowns is just wrong. Funny, but wrong. How many title cards are they going to show? And the title can suggest the attitude of the filmmaker toward his subject. So M. Night Shyamalan should have title cards with a big pile of shit on them. Only commies don't like dingbats. Perhaps more important, the title can reflect the diligence and imagination of the filmmaker. In this it case, he has none. The confidence of the viewer and prepares him to accept what follows the But title. what the heck is a dingbat? Course, this looks like something Bush pushed for. The spell out in detail what the film is going to be about. So far, Ann told us. Or it can be purposely obscure and intriguing. Well, it failed to intrigue me. I expect Edith another, Bunker to go ORG any second now. And gives him a mental attitude toward the movie he's about to see. Because titles are so important, they are planned and executed with painstaking attention to detail. Which none of this was used for the title of this film. Something goes wrong. Oh, that's terrible. Most people your age are well potty true. trained. Y you mean you didn't notice it either until you finished making the print? These were supposed to be naked pictures of my girlfriend, well, not my wife. Make it over right away. And I'm sure sorry. Damn, what an asshole. Ah! Kill it! Kill it with fire! Another bad one. And this one's a Lulu. This guy looks like a cab going down the street with the doors open. Oh no. He's oh, wondering if the, the other guy can get I any uglier. Right this time, huh? The client's mad. I don't He's blame the product of an unholy menage a trois between Ichabod Crane, a cab with its doors no. open, and the elephant. We don't want to lose the account, so uh, when you do it over, how's about throwing in a little something extra to... Make him happy, you know. Like surprises. Janet from accounting. Maybe something a little bit uh, fancier than he'd expect. Uh, you know, uh, something to give the title a little uh, oomph. And don't do it in crayon this time. Say no more. We'll take care of it this time. He wants to touch that face to see if it's real. Oh, boy. He's going to beat me with the ugly Ooh, stick again. I just dead. know it. What can you do with the Dean Bat story? Wipe your ass on it. I just gotta come up with something. Yes, you do, because we can't handle seeing you after any more beatings with the ugly stick. Hey, 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 you guys! Come now he thinks this is an problem. episode of the Electric Company. Come on, come on now. now look. Oh, come on now, this is an emergency. The client is, uh, mad. Well, come it's on. not our fault the client went nuts. Come on, I'm going to tell you. Now look, now look. We've got a bad title again, and the I mean, who the hell makes a film called The Dingbat Story? Huh? Okay? Now, this is what I had in mind. We're going to turn in a big pile of shit, so everyone take a laxative. Something to show the people. Now, How ugly I am. Something really exciting to get the title off in a real good swirl, huh? You know what else swirls? Uh, Toilets. Let me show Let me show Now look, you take a square. Now what do you think? Huh? We think what you're a freaking loon. What do you think? Uh -huh. Listen, let's do it. They're setting up a kill box to lure the client into if he hates the title again. Mm -hmm. 
na 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 Batman. So all they do is make Batman emblems? Who's the client? Bruce Wayne? The Teen Titans Go version of Man Bat is horrible. Just a few more pieces and I'll win my game of concentration. Can you blow my whistle, baby, whistle, yeah. baby, let me know. First we start with a black background. And then we, we shit on it. We scratch on this bat outline. Then we drank Next two we fits of vodka and called it a day. It. And zoom it up to fill the screen. With my we hands. By dissolving with a ripple glass to bring in a colored background. Then we shit on then it we again. Use the flip lens and turn the screen over a couple of times. Now we want to use some live action in the background. But we can't sucker well, anybody into doing it. We're going to use these cutouts to map them in. Man, Google Maps keeps getting the stronger. Image, and the cameraman can do freeze frame and skip Freeze frame. frame. Freeze frame. Freeze frame. Now freeze. Once again, what the hell is a dingbat? To pop in the letters one at a time. That last and one popped in two letters. We'll zoom them up and split them apart. They'll we'll never know what the hit them. Backgrounds and dissolve to the animation sequence. Say, how is the animation coming along? Come on, I don't know. It's not my job. Hey, hey, how's it going? It would be going a lot faster if you shut the hell up and leave me alone. We decided to use a little bad character in order to make the title more appealing. People still want to know what the heck a dingbat is. Back, but I felt by moving his ears forward, it gave him a more darted effect. But Dude, are you drawing a bat or a dart? So I shortened the wings, and he just worked out great. We're going to be married next month. But it's an animated character. character. Don't judge our love. I wanted him to fly all over the screen, so I made this plot. He's plotting so something. I'd exactly watch him. Each movement is. But because he's moving in perspective, I had to develop this little clay model. You can see here the way he's Looks moving like around. Looks like Count Chocula in bat form. I draw him accurately in every position. The girls still have quite a bit of inking and painting to do. Yeah, well, give the, the women the hard jobs, typical man. That is just great! Dude, I think you got some spittle on me. Dad, stop drooling. Ma'am, your bus is giving off some form of radiation. Will somebody tell me what's going on? We're having a circle jerk over this model. Background with hard work. Raise your hands, raise your hands if you're sure. Is someone gonna sing I'm going home? Dad, I told you to stop that drooling. Hurry up you guys, we're gonna shoot the moon landing. The reason they keep reshooting is they want to get a steady shot, which will look good with lettering over it. And thus the idea for the design of the Emmy was born. The cameraman is getting creative, but it won't work. She's not the gonna put out will for be him. The smoothest and steadiest. They see me rolling, they hating, they know I be filming dirty. On the animation stand, the title is first shot in silhouette to make but a still, mask. what the it's hell is a dang bat? Picture for one exposure. D and G drunk national guard. Place. Speaking of masks, we're still not sure if the ugly we guys wearing one or not. From the animation to the live action by using a set of artwork masks. Here's the last scene. We plan a real big finish. Sadly, we can't so use it because it's too dirty. The scene with this animated beach ball. It'll be over this background, and we'll dissolve on this shape and the bat. It was and about to be run over by the 315 from Yuma. Got it all timed out for you here on the exposure sheet. They've got a schedule for exposing themselves? Some what the hell? A lightning effect and some double print rocket bursts for a big finish. Followed by a pic of your mom's vagina. Boy, this is going to be some title. Too bad we blew the budget on hookers and heroin. Have the music director get some good music and sound effects, huh? He said good music, not this shit. This must be the advanced knob turning class. Stripping, you're doing it wrong. Oh, well, you see how it moves. I can't remember when I saw, saw such, such ugliness, but enough about me looking in the mirror. Just got here. What do you say we take a look at it? Except for you, Tony. Well, I 
understand you guys been working pretty hard on this one, huh? Not really, we just took big shit on it. Funny thing is, the client probably won't even realize that you did anything different. Because he's too damn stoned. Hey, this looks kind of long, doesn't it? So is this film about no, making it? you guys didn't do too good a job. I mean, we wouldn't want to set the clients a good example, now would we? They might expect us to really do our jobs. Next time. Maybe we ought to just break off an end and send him that. How about we break our foot off in your ass? It's perfect just the way it is. The best work we've ever done. Well, I'm replacing you with trained monkeys anyway. Gee, that's a shame. Because as good as you say it is, I'm sure the client won't want to use it. Because I know your best work is shit. Uh-uh. It'll make his show seem bad, by comparison. Like this we film. But it'll set new standards for titling. The world is waiting. We've got to think of our audience. Damn it, Frank, stop being a diva. Good work. But you've got to wait until the people are ready to appreciate it. Until they're willing to pay for it. And become but desperate enough to hire you clowns. Okay. Let's roll the film. Good, another captive audience to watch this shitty film. I know, they can't leave because they're in the film. you damn right. 20th Century Fox presents some lame crap Sony did. So Dingbat's a bat in a belfry? Can we just shoot these whores? Dad, the film's on the fritz. They must have done a shit ton of cocaine. I've heard of stuttering when you talk, but stuttering when you move? Rah, 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 this film sucks. And the crowd signals for him to play Wiggle. So Dingbat is a cheap Batman knockoff? Let's throw random crap in the background. What in the hell are we watching? I don't know. It looks like Lent on a spin cycle. And the title goes into a tailspin and going to crash. The bat moves by flapping its wings and farting glitter. Someone call Kesha and tell her that her pet's on the loose again. Count Chocula's drunk again. Dad, put your tongue back in your mouth. That's just gross. The bat is cute. Too bad it's about to be run over by a train and struck by lightning. I can now say I've seen something worse than Jar Jar Binks. Dear Burke Rednecks, we don't make bad movies, we make bad movies better.